640, welcome back. Consumer 10 now following up on a growing outbreak that's worrying poultry farmers. At least nine states have reportedly have cases of highly pathogenic avian influenza virus so far this year. Connecticut and Iowa were added to the list on Thursday. Birds at the Detroit Zoo were even moved indoors as a proactive measure after a bird flu was identified in a backyard flock of non-poultry birds in Kalamazoo County. Ohio, though, has not had a case yet, but poultry producers are on a heightened biosecurity alert. The Ohio State University Department of Veterinary Preventative Medicine has been closely monitoring the, this. And Associate Professor Andrew Bowman says the precautions taken are similar to the pandemic. PPE, cleaning feeding water and sources and tracking people in contact with birds and also washing trucks. We have multiple response plans already drawn up. Um, of how we would control it, and that's based on what the virus is and where it's at and, and you know, various contingency plans. Now, Bowman says right now there's a very small impact on consumers, and he reminds people that there's no viral transmission evidence in poultry products.